onion prices will take at least a month of stabilize, said the government secretary after meeting with shareholders. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina sought Russian support and cooperation to set up another nuclear power plant in the southern region. Bangladesh reported 11 more deaths from COVID-19 in the last 24 hours and the toll rise to 27,699. And Durga Puja, the biggest religious festival of Bengali Hindu community, has begun today. Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my TV news. I'm Fawzia Roshan with you in the newsroom today. We are still watching the headlines and I'm going to the details. Commerce Secretary Tapan Kanti Ghosh has said that onion prices will take at least a month of stabilize. He made the remark while addressing the media after a meeting on the current stock, import, supply and prices of daily essentials held at the Secretariat today. Commerce Minister Tipu Munshi, High Officials of the Ministry, MBR, Trading Corporation of Bangladesh, TCB, Bangladesh Competition Commission, BCC, stakeholders and business leaders attended the meeting. The Commerce Secretary said onion prices have shot up due to the heavy downpours in Bangalore, India. Traders of the neighboring countries are also responsible for this. According to the Agriculture Ministry, the situation will take at least a month of stabilize. Until the supply of new onions increase, he further said, we have already sent a letter to NBR for the withdrawal of the 5% duty on onion imports. We had a discussion on the overall situation of the essential commodities market, mainly onion prices. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina today sought Russian support and cooperation to set up another nuclear power plant in the country's southern region. The Premier said this while Russian State Economic Energy Corporation, Rostmas Director Jan Alexa Lekachev, called on her at her official residence Gonobobon this morning. Bangladesh is setting up its first ever nuclear power plant at Rupur in Pabna with the technical and financial support of Russia. Russian State Economic Energy Corporation, Rosatom is providing this support, laying utmost emphasis on the security issues. The Premier urged the Rosatom Director General to train up local people. So they run the nuclear power plant. Alexei Lekachev said cooperation between Bangladesh and Russia stepped into atomic spare and Bangladesh will become a country addressed with nuclear energy and power by 2023. Bangladesh reported 11 more deaths from COVID-19 in the last 24 hours, bringing the tally from the pandemic to 27,699. On the other hand, the total caseload stood at 15,62,958 and 599 more tested positive for the virus during the same period. It was said in a press release signed by Professor Nasima Sultana, Additional Director General of Health Services. The current positivity rate is 2.58%. Percent. A total of 23,196 samples were tested at 815 centers across the country in the last 24 hours. Online year ticketing agency 24ticket.com has embezzled Taka 50 crore in name of a selling tickets of Biman Bangladesh Airlines. Kamrul Asan, Deputy Inspector General of the Criminal Investigation Department CID, made the disclosure in a press conference today. Mohammed Nazrul Islam, Head of Operations at Tole, Com Accounts Officer Sohali Hosan, Digital Communications Officer Tariq Mohammed Anik, Sales Executive Officer Sajad Hosan, Call Center Officer Munna Parvez, and the Supervisor Masum have been arrested. They were arrested on Sunday on the basis of secret information from different areas of the capital. CID, DIG Kamrul Ahasan said, preliminary investigations have revealed that Mizanur had embezzled a tax of 50 crore from customers at various types in the name of selling Biman tickets.
Three U.S.-based economics owned the 2021 Nobel Prize for Economics on Monday for work on drawing calculations from United Experiments on so-called natural experiments. David Kurt of the University of California at Berkeley was awarded one half of the prize, while the other half has been shared by Joshua Agrest from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology and Guido Labels from Stanford University. The Royal Swedish Academy of Science said three have a completely rushed empirical work in the economic sciences. Unlike the other Nobel Prizes, the Economics Award wasn't established in the will of Alfred Nobel, but by the Swedish Central Bank in his memory in 1968. With the first winner selected a year later, it is the last prize announced each year. Durga Puja, the biggest religious festival of Bengali Hindu community, began today with the Moha Shosti Puja at temples across the country amid festivity and religious favor. The five-day-long Durga Puja celebration has begun with the unveiling of the face of the deity and Kalaforba on the day of Moha Shosti, and it will come to the end on October 15 with the immersion of the idols of Goddess Durga in rivers. According to Bangladesh Puja Udjapan Parishad, this year, 32,118 puja mandabs have been set up across the country, while the number was 30,213 last year. On the other hand, the number of puja mandabs in Dhaka Metropolitan this year is 238. All the preparations have been taken for the smooth celebrations of the festival. Rain or thunder showers are campaigned by temporary gusty winds likely to occur at one or two places over Kulna, Borishal and the Chotogram divisions. A Met Office release said today, it said weather may remain mainly dry with temporary partly cloudy sky wells rare over the country. Day and night temperature may remain nearly unchanged over the country. The axis of a monsoon runs through Bihar, West Bengal to Asham across the central part of Bangladesh. Monsoon is less active over Bangladesh and weak over North Bay. Viewers, we're about to the end of the headlines once again. Onion prices will take at least a month of stabilize, said the Commerce Secretary after meeting with stakeholders. Prime Minister Shri Kasina sought Russia's support and the cooperation to set up another nuclear power plant in the southern region. Bangladesh reported 11 more deaths from COVID-19 in the last 24 hours and the toll rise to 27,699. Durga Puja, the biggest religious festival of Bengali Hindu community has begun today. Australian city Sydney has emerged from lockdown after almost four months with the locals celebrating a range of new freedoms. And France defeated Spain by 2-1 goals in the final of the UEFA Nations League. That's all from our newsroom for now. Thanks for being with us. To join with My TV News Online, visit YouTube slash My TV BD News. And to watch all our programs, visit YouTube slash My TV Bangla, Facebook slash My TV Bangla. Our next bulletin will be telecast in Bangla at 7.30 p.m. Don't forget to join with us. Till then, stay connected. Viewers, be careful to prevent coronavirus and follow the hygiene rules. Allah Hafiz.